Hey guys, GameBoy3800 here once again, back playing Minecraft. That's all we're calling it now. Last episode, we fell into a big pit, and I lost a lot of life, and found some iron. We dug our way out, and started cooking it. And now we're here. And since I was cooking iron, I decided to cook up all the beef we just got. The last episode as well. So that's that. Should be holding. Uh, the bow is fully good. So let's be holding the diamond pickaxe when we take out these things. Because then mending will go and fix that. Could have sworn I heard something. Oh no, I'm holding. Holding the bow. Okay, so that's a full stack of that. Let's just eat the pumpkin pie here. And start putting the extra steak here. And there we go. We're slowly getting its durability back up. Maybe when I go to the nether, I'll put on the fire protection three iron chest plate because that will protect me against the fire much better. But then I'll have less durability against, say, like a wither skeleton or something or a blaze. Or maybe it'd be okay against a blaze because it blazes main way of Attacking is by throwing its fire at you. Same for a magma cube. You, you get burned. So anyways. Now we need to keep going in a constant direction. Make sure we don't get too lost. But I do want to explore uh, down here just a little bit to see what's around. Because, whoa. Ooh, mineshaft. We're going there. Hmm. Is I open to land? Game mode survival. Start land world. Okay. Alright, what I want to do is just put it on peaceful so I don't become died down there. But can I change difficulty? No, I cannot. Okay. Game difficulty to peaceful. Okay, you can do that. Just doing this to fly down here and not get hurt. Okay, so what's around here? Spider spawner of some sort. Thankfully, because peaceful. Oh, I'm not going to get down there easily. Let's see if I can walk around here. There's no easy way to get around that, is there? Is that a standard spider spawner or a cave spider spawner? That's a cave. Definitely a cave spawner, so yeah. Okay, so a sword can be used to cut through this stuff. That's good to know. And then all of the XP.
None of that went to me because it all went to mending. Oh no, that's all. No. Okay, so I must have picked up some string. Oh, I have a single piece of dirt. Awesome. Always lovely to have that single piece of dirt that's keeping me from getting the ores that I need and want. And there's a minecart here with lots of torches. And a piece of bread. I will add the piece of bread to my collection, pick up all the torches, and use them here. So you get that? I hear lava someplace, so you've got to be careful. Let's head towards the light, even though that probably is where the lava is. There's more iron over here. Let's get all of it. We probably will find a full stack of iron just by staying in here. Oh, this is where a big ravine is, and it connects. So if I just walked around here and looked in the ravine, and there's the lava, oh wow, it connects in multiple places. And it connects here as well. Another minecart. Got some iron in it. A name tag and more torches. It is a shame you don't get. Uh, experience from mining coal, or uh, iron, I mean. So, in order to keep this thing's durability up, I'm gonna mine some of this. Even though I don't need coal, actually I probably do need a couple pieces. There we go, I probably got a couple pieces. Because we did use some to cook all of our food and stuff. Oh no, that's all. And that's all. Thankfully, it's just a lot on two more tracks. And to another cart. A golden apple, standard. So there's that. Let's... We're gonna have to get rid of something to hold it. Let's get rid of the bone meal. I can find more of that by killing a skeleton. big but let's head this way and there's more iron here so good thing we turned around and did the thing two chunks of iron well and if there's no more around here let's just head on down here and get the iron now. There's more iron right here, so let's get it and hope it doesn't get swept away. There we go. over here 
Oh, it's night time. There we go. Not a not a mine shaft, but there is coal. I keep mixing those up, why? And we have 46 so far. I assume we're gonna have a very full stack and we're gonna have no use for getting any more of it. I believe this is where we just were. Yep. So coming back up here. This is where the lava was. Let's not go say hello to it. See if we can meet up. There we go. Safely walk past it. More iron. Uh, just a one piece, okay. Oh, tons of spider webs. There's another spawner over there. Oh, I fell. Thankfully, it's right in the open here, and I can just destroy it. Yay. And the durability is coming back up. Get more iron here as well. And oh, not quite a full stack. Actually, still have quite a ways to go. And I'm actually surprised about the lack of any other ore around here. You'd think we'd find gold, but I guess we're not quite that deep yet. We got a flinch from that. Too bad we don't need it. And that's a full stack. We don't need any more iron. Suppose we could do the math and just cook up uh, enough iron to get a full stack here and then keep mining here. That sounds like not a bad idea. So you get some. That actually could be enough to, no, it won't. okay. That will be enough. So, 42, that'll be 52, and this will be 63. So, it 
should be just enough. And then do I have anything else that I need cooking down here? No, it doesn't quite seem like it. Slowly getting our, our thing back up. This will also let me get more coal and more experience for the pickaxe. Take half of those out since I'm pretty sure this will be all we'll need. So two there and one here. So 61, two there. So just one more and that's all we will need. And then we can start mining until this is a full stack again. Yay. So now I have 60 uh, coal. And this one will be it. Yay. Nothing here. There we go. I may have mined there, I can't tell. There's actually a ton of water going through this mine shaft. Why? Is there like a lake above us? You wouldn't think so. All right, here's another spawner. All of the XP. Another mending book, all right. Uh, let's keep that around. What's in this chest? Uh, let's not throw that in the lava like I almost did before. Another golden apple is always nice. Uh, single piece of coal. <laughs> okay. All right, so this mending will definitely come to use. Um, let's go ahead and put it on right now. So I'll put my furnaces in there. Get on my anvil. Get on my diamond chest plate. And the mending. So a diamond chest plate. And mending. Awesome. I don't know how many more. Oh, it's dead. Oh, no, I have it. Very damaged anvil. So, furnace is here. Uh, it's probably night time. So, now it's day. So yeah, that's that. That's probably going to be the end of this episode. We will continue our long and eventful journey in the next video.
Actually, wait, no, we're only halfway done. I'm saying we're halfway done. And nice stairs leading to nothing. Okay. So now we have mending on quite a few things. That will repair it if it ever gets damaged. Lots of web over here. There could be another spider spawner if I didn't already destroy it. that. See some actual daylight. And 51 of that. So yeah, doing very good here. Probably should not have fallen down here since I don't see anything of interest. Alright, let's make a way back up. Hmm. Oh, we can go further down. Okay. And I didn't mean to go this far down. Yeah, we find iron. It's fine. Just two. Oh no, more than two. Awesome. Quite a bit more than two actually, wow. Uh, lava down here, it sounds like. Whoa. What level are we at? 28. Uh, two high for diamonds. Do I have a water bucket? Yes, I do. Let's make a thing here. And that covers it all. Awesome. So now we made a safe path. What's over here that you're hiding? Looks like a normal cave. And gold. Yes, finally gold. But I have to drop something. I do need to drop something here. I will drop my carrots. Actually, no. I can make golden carrots with the gold we're about to get. Mm -hmm. There's more gold down there too, so it's not like the one patch is a fluke. We're at gold level. Gold level 27. Or 28 if we jump here. <laughs> it's a gold. It's only really valuable for making golden items or trading with if someone really wants to get some gold. Because, because gold gear is pretty much worthless because wood gear is pretty much better in every way. 
Now you have a very damaged anvil. Like, surprise, it's still working anvil. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, let's get one more use out of it. Right now. Get our axe. And a few iron ingots. To repair it. And anything else we can do that with? A uh, stone? Nope. Diamonds? No, I'm not going to waste a diamond on repairing it. It's got mending. And it's still good, but it's very damaged. So let's just get it, leave the damage angle. I will make a new one. So just three there. So we also have some more iron up here. And here. And I have a full stack of that again. But I can go ahead and cook some up. And by some, I mean literally only three. So I can remake the stack and pick up a few more pieces. And meanwhile, lava. Yep, gold isn't great, but it is resourceful, I guess. So that's that. So now I can get one more piece of coal and a couple more pieces of iron. And here's a couple more pieces of iron. Ooh, and redstone. Uh, unfortunately, redstone is not going to be made here. I can't tell if lava was there, or if that set cobblestone. There's a flower down here of all places. Right, full of stack. All right, there's some water there. Uh, there is more around here. Other than, actually, there isn't any more around here other than redstone. And then down there was probably just lava. And then there's no way that's set cobblestone. Yep, it was definitely made by this water. Uh, nope, I'm not going to get pushed into lava. That's not what I'm going to do. I'm just getting a better look over there. Yeah, redstone's cool. First time seeing it in the ground in this playthrough. But yeah. Gold and diamonds are what we're actually looking for. Not so much gold, but, you know, couldn't hurt to have it. So much lava at this level. And I'm pretty sure we're just completely not anywhere near the mine shaft anymore. Just doing that to get rid of that lava. Make it somewhat safer. Now let's start hitting up again. So that we can try to find our mine shaft. There's spider webs, that's probably where it was. Yep, it was up here. So good thing we found that. Yeah, unfortunately, we can't really get down much lower without risking lava. We do have a water bucket that could definitely save us from it, but I 
don't want to think of the consequences. And there's more gold down here, so that was worth a check at least. You'd think that because gold is so weak, it'd be super easy to mine, but no, it takes a few seconds with the diamond pickaxe. All right, 18 now, wow. How much lower can we go? And there's nothing over here but gold, okay. So it's definitely nighttime, and now it's going to be the end of the episode. So if you guys enjoyed us finding all this awesome stuff, please go ahead, leave a like, favorite, comment, share, and of course subscribe. Thanks, Game Boy Out. I will see you in the future.